So here we are, back by popular demand. When I say popular demand, I mean like, you know, two or three people said it was quite amusing. What's going on everybody? Secret she's back, part two. Wear shoes of 2020. Now, full disclosure, I'm a bit hungover today. You know what I mean? I'm not really feeling it. Leeds got promoted last night. Got a bit messy around my gaff, I'm not gonna lie. But I think it might actually help. The hangover might actually help with the negativity of the worst shoes of 2020. So, let's get straight into it, yeah? Oh yeah, full disclaimer before I start. Now, I'm good at trapping off, aren't I? I'm good at saying, oh, this is rubbish, this is rubbish. I can't make a shoe. I've never designed a shoe. Shout out to all the brands out there. I know I'm just a big mouth. Savage King, Salty by Nature, that's me. I accept it. Sue me. Wear shoes of 2020. Let's go. Right, starting off today, Kai 54, Jordan 6. Now, we got a mock-up of this before it came out. It looked like this. That is sweet, innit? That is proper wavy. Looks nice with a suede. Looks beautiful. I was gonna buy that joint. Without doubt, I was gonna buy that joint. Yeah, but thing is though, we didn't get that. That was just a mock-up. What did we get? We got this. Grandma's tablecloth. Grandma's tablecloth on a Jordan 6. That's what we got. You know what? It's like hooking up with Ariana Grande on Tinder. And you're like, oh, Ariana's coming. Oh my God, that pocket rocket. She says, yeah, I'm on my way. I'm on my way now. You get a knock at the door. You open it. You're like, yes, you open the door. Grot bags is there. Grot bags. You thought you were getting Ariana? You got grot bags. And what's worse, grot bags haven't got any clothes on. She's just wearing grandma's tablecloth. Next up, the Stan Smith mule. The Stan... <laughs> <laughs> the Stan Smith Mule. Stan Smith, quality classic trader. One of the best, yeah? They made this. They made this out of it. They took the Stan Smith and they made it into this. Can you believe what you're looking at? One minute. Hey, is that John? Yeah, it's Dave from Adidas, yeah. Yeah, I was just looking at the designs for the next quarter, John, yeah. Can you tell me you designed the Stan Smith Mule? That was you. Oh, well, you're fired. Yeah, yeah, you're fired, John, yeah. Why? Well, I looked at the stance with you and my retina's detached. That's why, John. Isn't that a good enough reason? What are you going to do now? To be honest, John, I don't know. I couldn't give a monkeys, to be honest. Jump off the nearest cliff, become a traffic warden. Do whatever you want, John. As long as I don't have to see or hear from you again, yeah? All right, John. All right, yeah, all the best, John. See you later, John. Bye. Remember, you're fired. Next up, Under Armour. Machina. They say a picture tells a thousand words, don't they? Not this one. Just one. Shit. Next up, EQT Gazelle. Check out that colourway. Ooh. What are they actually doing? Do you think they actually talk to the general public before they put these shoes out? They can't do. They can't talk to normal human beings. Because they wouldn't put that out, would they? They would not make that shoe. Can you imagine if they had a focus group with like normal people? And normal people, they go in there and Mr. Adidas is like, so did you like the shoe? And the normal person is like, Mr. Adidas, no, I hated the shoe. And they're like, oh, why, why, what was it? Was it the colorway? Was it not comfortable enough? No, Mr. Adidas, I hate the shoe because I have eyes. Next up, 380. Oh, Yeezy 380, we meet again. We meet again, sunshine. 380 is the year. Now, this isn't as bad as the Blue Oak. I can't say that. Do you know what I mean? Nothing's going to beat the Blue Oak. That thing is undefeated, all right? That's Floyd Mayweather, that. But still not great, is it? And I can't help but picture Mr. Hankey in that shoe. All I can think of is Mr. Hankey wearing it. I can't picture anyone else wearing it. And it sort of just puts me off. Do you know what I mean? Just imagine him dancing around. Howdy ho! Look at my free it is. I can't imagine anyone else in that shoe. So I've got to put it in there. Thing is, though, it is only a mock-up. So who knows? I'm sure, you know, the real one be much better. Next up, Clamical Vento Adidas. You tell me. But to be honest, I, I really don't know. The midsole looks like an explosion in a Colgate factory. And the outsole, I, what is that? What is the outsole? Is that like you stole Mike Wazowski's dentures out of his mouth? Thought you put them on an outsole? Is that really what people want these days? I, I'm baffled by it, to be honest. I feel like Roz. Maybe I am. I look a bit like Ross, to be fair. If I was going to be anyone in Monsters, Inc., I'd be Ross. Hey, Wazowski. Hey, Adidas. Stop making crab trainers. Next up, Adidas Nizza pouch pack. What? What is that? 
I, I know I'm hungover and I know I'm annoyed, but for the love of God, Adidas, what are you going to put in the pouch? What are we going to put in the... I'll tell you what I put in the pouch. The whole shoe. Can I put the whole shoe in the pouch? Can I stuff it in the pouch, Adidas? Who thought that was a good idea? A bum bag on the front of your shoe, bruv. You lot just... Oh my God! Last up today. Woo! Unbelievable. Mizuno. Mizuno Energy. Energy. Not energy. Energy. Are you taking the piz? What is that? It looks like it's got an allergy. It's just bubbles everywhere, bro. Do you really think anyone's gonna... And tell you what, even worse than that. I know it looks crap. Do you know what's even worse? Do you know how much that costs? I'll wait. $300. $300 for that. $300 for something with a nut allergy. Really? You're gonna buy something with a nut allergy for $300? You might as well buy someone a Snickers. Unbelievable. My God, that shoe. Mizuna Energy taking the piss. Thanks for tuning in, people. I think part three will come at some point, you know, because these shoes just keep on coming and coming, don't they? If you like part three, comment down below. Thanks very much. Please like, please subscribe. Thanks for rocking with me. I'm a bit hungover, I'm a bit rough, but do you know what? I think it might have helped. Thanks very much. All the best to you. Have a great, great week. You got to say, bruv? My guy. Yes. See you next week. Thanks, everyone.